Hey everybody, Sneaky Narcotic, back at it again with another YouTube video, and in today's video, I have a real special treat for you. I have been sponsored by a new Magic the Gathering product called Magic the Gathering Loot Chest. It is a loot box type of product that you can either subscribe to and get monthly, or you can just buy one box at a time at your he has multiple different boxes on his website. I bought a standard uh, box, I believe is what it's called, and it comes with the most three of the most recent standard packs, a play mat, and either a deck box or deck sleeves. Now, I've already recorded these videos that you're about to see. I do want to mention I got the prices wrong, so I will be in the t uh, text box below putting a accurate pricing on these products that was given to me by the by the owner of Magic the Gathering Loot Chest. Um, I do also want to mention, of course, I will be putting his website and his Patreon in the description down below. So go ahead and check that out. Um, but without further ado, let's get into these unboxing videos. Alright guys, here's the box. Uh, as you can see, <laughs> it is made in the USA, and it is recyclable, just like it says. Um, <clears throat> I have my handy-dandy little opening knife here, just for opening boxes, nothing else. Let's see what we got inside here. Well, it's a little dull in opening boxes, but it still gets the job done. Oh man, look at all that stuff in there. I can get this in the lighting a little better. So this is all that comes in the loot box. That I got for 25 bucks. Comes with a spin down. A random uh, token, which I actually got a beautiful little foil Marchesa here. Very nice. Oh man, a box of dragon shields. Let me see if I can get that in the light for you guys. A box of dragon shield, no glare. Look at that glare though, right? No glare dragon shield matte art card sleeves. Which ones? I don't even know what those look like yet. And then, got a play mat. Let's see if I can open that up. I might have to show y'all just a second without the box. Hey. Oh man, yeah, that's super awesome squirrel. I'll show that in a second. Super awesome squirrel playmat. <clears throat> Pack of cards? <laughs> I don't even know what this is about. Let me see if I can get these open here. So, a Rasta of the Endless Web. This looks like it came from my. Uh, Theros, if I'm not mistaken, with that little mana symbol right there. Or right, with a set symbol right there. The Rasta of the Endless Web. Oiled Plains. Oiled... Oh, wow. So this must be like some land set that he sent me as well. Oh, wow. All foiled basic lands. Plus that Rasta. Nice. Let me put that to the side now. Oh... And he gave me three packs of Magic the Gathering. Since I did buy the standard, they're all standard packs of Magic the Gathering. Core 2021 there. Ikoria. And Throne of Eldraine. Let's see what I got. Just for fun. Actually, didn't pay attention much to the uh, M21 set. I really don't know much of these cards. I did know that they reprinted the Sanctums. I haven't really seen these cards in action. Even in Standard right now, like on uh, Arena, I really haven't seen a lot of M21 cards. Unless you're talking about, of course, the Teferi um, Mill Yourself stuff. But this is still pretty good. It's pretty good for $25. 
I got three packs of cards, which would have cost me like 15 bucks at the store. I got a pack of dragon shields. I don't, I don't really know how much dragon shields really cost, especially like, I believe this is a hundred pack, 104 pack of dragon shields. I mean, oh man, I'm gonna open those up next after the packs here. Let's see what I got in my packs. Throne of Eldraine was a set that I played a lot of, though. I really loved the little Fable Tales Throne of Eldraine <laughs> Dwarven Mine. Oh, man, I got a Cauldron of Eternity. That's like... Last time I checked, it was a $12 card. I have no clue what it is now, but it's a pretty good card right there. See, my last pack here from Ikoria. Ikoria was a good set too, but I bought I didn't really even buy hold on. I didn't really even buy regular boosters because I wanted to get the uh wanted to get the Tyco or the um not the Tyco, the Kaijo, uh the monsters. Flame spell. Oh, I think that's one of the um. God, I might be mistaken, but I could have sworn that was one of the. Du -du -du -du. No, it's not. This is just one of the legendary creatures. For a second, I thought that was one of the random um. Now foiled. That is avian oddity. But yeah, I thought it was one of the uh, commanders for a second. I, I honestly have forgotten what the commanders were from Throne of Eldraine. It was so long ago for me. Um, let me go ahead and open my dragon shields here. Oh, yeah, look at that. Big dragon shield. Look at that. All right, let me move the box out of the way and see if I can't get the uh, play mat on here. Just a second. I'll get to see my dirty little desk. Kids keep all their artwork and everything. Oh yeah, I guess I should still show these off a little bit too. Oh, that Marchesa looks amazing. I love these. I really love these, uh, I think they're called relic, uh, relic tokens. But, like, being able to keep your life total here, keep your commander damage right there, that's pretty good. And then, as well as my little spin down from Theros. Let's see. I think the play might might be just a little too big to see. Oh, and of course I have it upside down. We'll see. <laughs> yeah, just this little Star City Games um squirrels play mat. Super nice. Don't make my friend jealous. He loves squirrels. God, it feels super clean. <laughs> the other side of it. Desk is too small. <laughs> but yeah, guys, so that's the um that's the box in its entirety. Honestly, I think it's a really good deal for twenty five bucks. I got a fifteen dollar play mat. I got the um, the dragon shields, which are about fifteen. Three packs of uh, Magic: The Gathering, which is about fifteen. The relic token, which is five bucks, and the spin down, which to be fair has no monetary value for real. You get them with every single set. Uh, but like I know at my shop they sell them for about a buck. So what's that? That's uh, fifteen, 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 five, a buck. So that's fifty-one dollars 
for 25 bucks. Pretty good. Um, I really thank uh, Magic the Gathering Luke Box for supporting this channel. And uh, I really appreciate the box that he sent me. Um, I have another one I'm going to open up. I'm, I might record that one. I might not. Um, but if I do, go ahead and check that video out. And thank y'all for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. I'll have some more uh, content coming soon. I will also be opening some more of these loot boxes uh, in the future. There's some like modern and some commander loot boxes that are uh, out there. And I will definitely be opening those up as soon as I get them. Um, thanks again for watching, guys, and this is Sneaky Narcotic. Signing off.